saying things people already know out loud is tight. Avada Kedavra. You park in front of your house, I park in front of my house. We're here to learn, so we'll move on. What's up, everyone? It's Adam from FWCI, and uh, yeah, I, I was gonna do sequel month, but uh, I looked into it, and that looks like a very, very risky <laughs> journey to go on. Some of these Disney sequels, not the best. So I thought, let's do something that a lot of people in the comments have been recommending, and that is How to Train Your Dragon. I know this is not Disney, this is not Pixar, this is DreamWorks. For the sake of my ignorant self, uh, please understand that I'm just going to call all of these movies Disney because <laughs> that's just how I associate them in my mind. But never seen this movie. I assume it's about how to train a, your dragon. <laughs> is that what it is? I hope you're all enjoying the uh, content on the channel. I'm enjoying The Mandalorian Season 2 right now. I'm smashing through that. There's a little show about a, a creek. Um, Poo Poo Creek, we'll call it. I, I, it. Anytime I say the real name of that, YouTube thinks I'm swearing my head off. So it's a bit of a weird way to try and react to something without trying to say the name of it too much, but it's a great show and I recommend it. Moira is the best. Brooklyn Nine-Nine, uh, was it Top Gun Maverick? Made me cry. If you like seeing movies that make me cry, go watch the ending of uh, Top Gun Maverick. I don't, I can't explain it. Can't explain it. The tears just happened. Subscribe if you haven't already. How to Train Your Dragon. Let's do it. It's located solidly on the meridian of misery. Wow. I don't want to live in Burke. The only problems are the pests. Why is why pests? We're Vikings. We have stubbornness issues. This guy doesn't seem like much of a Viking. Morning. <laughs> That's Stoic the Vast. Chief of the tribe. Stoic the they say that when he was a baby, he popped a dragon's head clean off of its shoulders. When he was a baby? Yes, I do. I believe it. Any night furies? None so far. Good. So far, Stoic is the man. They need toothpicks, don't they? Craig Ferguson, I recognize you. Old village, lots and lots of new <laughs> that's houses. How, that's why the houses are all new. They keep getting destroyed and then rebuilt. Okay, Astrid's his uh, object of affection, huh? Oh. By this, we'll throw it for me. Oh! Hiccup, mate. You, sir, are playing a dangerous game. Keeping this much raw Vikingness <laughs> contained, there will be consequences. I'll take my chances. <laughs> a simple back. Exotic. Two heads, twice the status. Yeah, that would be quite the get. They have this nasty habit of setting themselves on fire. Alright, Mortal Kombat the movie CGI lizard. Never shows itself and never misses. No one has ever killed a Night Fury. That's why I'm going to be the first. Alright, are we going to kill it? Or are we gonna train it? Pick up, how is this gonna go horribly, horribly wrong? Oh no. Oh, I hit it? Yes, I hit it! Did anybody see that? Ooh. Dude, that thing is terrifying, man. No, it's still fire though. <laughs> Stoic is not going to take any of this. <laughs> so much destruction. Every time you step outside, disaster falls. Can you not see that I have bigger problems? Winter is almost here. And I have an oh Christ. That means Khaleesi and her dragons are going to show up as well. And White Walkers. <laughs> Quite the performance. I've never seen anyone mess up that badly. That helped. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I was trying. So. He sounds like Jonah Hill, but he looks like uh, Jack Black. 
Excuse me, barmaid. I'm afraid you brought me the wrong offspring. I ordered an extra large boy with beefy arms, extra guts and glory on the side. This here, this is a talking fish bone. No, you're thinking about this all wrong. Why doesn't he have an accent though? That's a good, <laughs> is that a good question? Or am I missing something? You know what he's like. From the time he could crawl, he's been different. <sighs> he doesn't listen. He has the attention span of a sparrow. I do feel like he's describing me there. <laughs> you know, bang my head against a rock, and I did it. I thought it was crazy, but I didn't question him. And you know what happened? You got a headache. That rock split in two. That was his two. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, the gods hate me. Some people. I do recognize this guy's voice. I can't remember his name, but he was in uh, End of the World with Seth Rogen and a bunch of other people. He's been in tons of stuff. I really should know this guy's name. Sorry, guy. You got it. Well done, Hiccup. It's a pretty small knife to go against a pretty big dragon there, man. You're not a Viking, Hiccup. Is he trapped or is he just having a nap? <laughs> Didn't kill him, but he did escape. In a kind of undignified fashion there as well. I guess he's a little bit screwed up still from getting harpooned. With a net. Do we have enough bread making Vikings or small home repair Vikings? You need this. I don't <laughs> want to fight dragons. <laughs> you talk like us, you think like us. No more of this. <laughs> Damn. Good. So that bugs me. Why didn't he tell his old man what was going on? Why didn't he say, by the way, I caught the. Night Fury or whatever it was, and um, I couldn't finish the job. And then I let it go, and now it's out there. The recruit who does best will win the honor of killing his first dragon in front of the entire village. Hiccup already killed a Night Fury, so right. does that disqualify him or? <laughs> oh yeah, no, he did though, buddy. Smart ass. You're small and you're weak. That'll make you less of a target. They'll see you as sick or insane and <laughs> plus eleven stealth times two. The monstrous nightmare. Firepower fifteen. The terrible terror. Attack aim. All right, this guy knows his stuff. That one has flower on it. Girls like flowers. Ah! Oops. Now this one has blood on it. <laughs> How many does a Gronkle have? Five. Unlimited. <laughs> Hiccup. Hmm. Why do I feel like this place would flood if it rained too much? Oh, what? He can't... Is he stuck in there? What's weird? Was there a video game of this? Because I feel like I've seen somebody playing a video game of this. He's missing half of his tail. Damn, like his little tail rudder thing. <laughs> he doesn't like you, man. Why read words when you can just kill the stuff the words tell you stuff about? <laughs> yeah, try the words. See how that goes for it. Oh, mine then. Wow. So, uh, okay. Uh, I'll see you, uh... What is it saying there about the uh, Night Fury? Timberjack. This gigantic creature has razor sharp wings that can slice through full grown trees. Jesus Christ! What is this thing? Scaldron. Sprays scalding water at its victim. Extremely dangerous. Scaldron? That's a good name. Night Fury. Uh huh. Size unknown. The unholy offspring of lightning and death itself. <laughs> wow. 
okay. Look for its blind spot. Every dragon has one. Find it, hide in it, and strike. Wait, is this is this blind spot directly in front of him? <laughs> How would one sneak up on a night fury? No one's ever met one and lived to tell the tale. Now get in there. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm a is this how it's supposed to work? <laughs> the, the dragon knocks down all the walls? Oh, that's true. <laughs> that thing, oh. Bringing it food? Yeah, you're not a Viking hiccup. You're a. You're the kind of dude that would bring a fish to an enemy dragon. Whatever kind of dude that is. <laughs> Hello, Night Fury. <gasps> Did he just do like the cat bum wiggle? Like they're about to pounce? No, no. <laughs> His eyes got so big there. He's like a cat. He's like a giant kitty cat. Look at him. His big old eyes. Toothless. I could have sworn you had <laughs> retractable teeth. <laughs> Is he sharing it? Like here you go, you have half. <laughs> what is that face? <laughs> 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 what is that? Big toothless grin? Too much. I can see so much of the behavior, not just visually, but just like the actual behavioral movements of this thing. It's like a cat. <laughs> I made a warm spot to lay in. That's great. Why are you hanging around with him so much? <laughs> I mean, he's a giant friendly dragon, don't get me wrong, but you just, you kind of moved in with him, Hiccup. He woke up, and then he's like, oh, you're still here. Oh my god, is he drawing something? Good work, mate. Good work, that's... <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's a picture of Hiccup. <laughs> I don't know about you, watch it. <laughs> Friends. I'll avenge your beautiful hand and your beautiful foot. I'll chop up the legs of every dragon I fight with my face. Uh, you talk colossal amounts of shit, mate. See? <gasps> your mom let you get a tattoo? Ooh, is Astrid about to get brought in on this? Oh, he's gonna build him a tail? Alright, Tony Stark, what do you got? Uh, I got some salmon. Some nice Icelandic cod and a whole smoked eel. All just for you, buddy. You eat it all. Oh, no, no. Okay. Yeah, I don't really like eel much either. <laughs> no eels. <laughs> it's a pretty clean slice for that thing to come off. <laughs> this oh okay hiccup <laughs> where are you being taken working he's out during the daytime as well he could be seen oh but well, he doesn't like it one head breathes gas the other head lights it <laughs> jeebus no hiccup 
Oh my god. Now, Dad, don't you make me tell you again. Yes, that's right. Back what is this? Now think about what you've done. Oh, you got the eel. <laughs> okay, so are we done? Because I've got some things I need. Hiccup, you just negotiated a dragon back into its bedroom. And why are there screws missing out of my shield? Alright. He's into it. Now we're gonna harness? Oh yeah, this is... Uh, he just wants to have a roll around in the grass? Oh, it's so cute. So how is he piecing all this information together though? Oh my god, look at him, he lo- <laughs> That's all the scratching I need today, thank you very much. Be gone. <laughs> oh, Astrid is the jealous rival now. Meet the terrible terror. How is he going to be the worst one? Oh. <laughs> Wow, he's better than you ever were. Alright, <laughs> calm down, mate. Astrid seems to be taking this very personal. Whoa! We sneaking Night Fury into the village now? Hiccup, you're gonna wind up and get a thousand Vikings after you. <laughs> I don't know what's worse, the Night Fury or a whole bunch of Vikings. <laughs> he's got he's got moves. Hiccup? Who would have thought it, eh? He has this way with the beasts. Yeah. He has does have a way with beasts. Like putting a harness on them and riding them and nursing them back to health. And giving them neck scratches. His name is Toothless? Sorry! You're still working out the... Oh... You're good, you're good. <laughs> Neither of them can fly, what the f... Oh, hiccup, man. Alright, Hiccup. Trial by fire. <laughs> Ah, uh, no thanks. I'm good. <laughs> He's already got his like, fish, a uh, fish on a stick. <laughs> you little vultures, seagulls. <laughs> That's enough. Oh no, they just like him. Oh my god. <laughs> Everything we know about you guys is wrong. There's some friendly dragons out there. Wait till you spill a nadder's guts for the first time. Oh, stoic. <laughs> All the while you are holding out on me. Oh, Thor Almighty. <laughs> He's very happy. <laughs> he's the happiest I think he's ever been in his life. Thanks. Ah, your mother would have wanted you to have it. It's half of her breastplate. <laughs> uh, thanks for stopping by I'm and for the, uh, you like the uh, breast hat. The hat. <clears throat> I'll, uh, yep. Good night. His dad is gigantic, by the way. He filled that entire room up. He's a clumsy bastard like his son. <laughs> this time, for sure. I respect her dedication to the Viking lifestyle. Oh, well, later. Uh oh, not so fast. Uh, I I'm kind of late for. What? No, is this the one he has to kill? You get to kill the dragon. Oh, 
hook up. Uh, are you gonna kill the dragon or are you gonna not kill the dragon? This is messed up. Ah, what the? Uh oh. It's okay. It's okay. She's a friend. <laughs> oh my god. What is she gonna say? He's gonna bloody dragon as a pet now. Astrid? Toothless. Toothless? Astrid. I got teeth. <laughs> and Toothless is like, good, leave. We didn't want you here in the first place. <laughs> Don't drop her, Toothless! Pick up! Wow. Get me down from here! <laughs> Quite a venue for this conversation. <laughs> a little warning growl. Yeah, don't you do anything up there, lady. <laughs> I love Toothless. His face in every scene is perfect. Toothless, what are you doing? We need her to like us! Toothless, a bit jealous? Is that what this is? Or he just hates Vikings, and she's very Viking-like. I'm sorry! Just get me off of this thing! <laughs> Toothless is just trying to get her to put her arms around him. It's quite the wingman, Toothless. No pun intended. Touch the clouds. Man, that's, uh... That'd be a hell of a thing to be able to do. I'm a 36-year-old man living in 2023. I've never touched a cloud before. Is that Aurora Borealis I see at this time of year, at this time of day, in this part of the country, localized entirely within this movie? For those that have watched a lot of my reactions, you'll know that I make that joke 100% of the time there's a uh, Aurora Borealis in any movie. I'm a Simpsons nut and I make no apologies. This is pretty cool. It's amazing. Alright, cool DC, you start to like it, huh? <laughs> That one have a shark between its feet? Holy shit. Oh, are they gonna find the nest? Wouldn't you have to find this? What are they? It's satisfying to know that all of our food has been dumped down a hole. <laughs> Thank you for your contribution, mate. <gasps> what is that? Alright, bud, we gotta get out of here. Whoa. Whoa! That big boy likes some uh, delicious humans? Is that what this is? Pickup, we just discovered the dragon's nest. The thing we've been after since Vikings first sailed here. And you want to keep it a secret? Yeah, that might be the end of the Vikings if you go after that thing, though. <laughs> That's for kidnapping me. Fair call. <laughs> oh my god, was Toothless just like, you want me to take her out or what? We good? Okay, we good. The hiccup to placing first in dragon training? Well, I would have tied him to a mast and shipped him off for feeding God mad! <laughs> Thanks for the encouraging speech, Dad. <laughs> just make sure they don't find Toothless. I will. Just Astrid is on board now. She, I guess she just had a big romantic moment on Toothless's back. Right, put that breast cup on your head. <laughs> mm, I would have gone for the hammer. Yeah, all right, Thor. Oh, it's one of these dudes. more dangerous than watching that like rally car racing out in the country in the UK what is he doing this is what he does every time have you not been paying attention everyone your mother's breasts are disappointed in you I said stop the fight god damn it old man <gasps> Is Toothless gonna come and save the day? Well, 
Look how fast he's running and flying. He's flunning. <laughs> All right. Oh no. Toothless, stop. No. No. Please. They hate me. I want to kill him. Whoa, whoa! Please, just, just don't hurt him! Please don't hurt him! What? Nah, man. This is messed up, man. Uh, it's all so messed up. Uh, yeah, I was just saying the same thing. Something else on their island, Dad. It's, it's a dragon like their you never... island! So you've been to the nest. Did I say nest? Mm, How did you find yeah. <laughs> Know what you're up against. It's like nothing you've ever seen. Dad, please. Man, stoic, you're being so stubborn right now. Please just listen to me. Hey, shit face. Listen to me. You're not my son. <sighs> Ready to shit. You know what? Go to your death, mate. My opinion on Stoic has changed drastically from the first 45 seconds of this movie. You're all gonna die, by the way. This is just a bunch of big floating coffins. That's all you're doing right now, guys. Who do you want to go to Valhalla with? Get on a boat with them. Hey! Lead us home, devil. What are you calling devil there, Mr. I'm wearing two horns? 300 years, and I'm the first Viking who wouldn't kill a dragon. <laughs> Something, I guess. First to ride one, though. <laughs> what are you gonna do about it? Eh, uh, probably something stupid. Good, but you've already done that. <laughs> Listen, Stoic, I was overhearing some of the men just now, and, and well, you know, some of them are wondering what it is we are up to here. Not, not me, of course. I, I... Stoic hasn't even told anyone what the plan is? Come on, man. What is this death wish you have? I love this plan. I didn't. You're crazy. I like that. No, okay. I was wondering where that went. Oh, these are all the ships that went out and never came back. Oh, he's gonna tame this spicy boy. All right. I like it when they're like not aggressive. They got these like big wide eyes. <laughs> where are you going? You're gonna need something to help you hold on. <laughs> that, that one down the front, the Grunkle, is that him? <laughs> Looked like you had one too many um, jazz cigarettes. Hmm, now what are you gonna do? We've done it! Oh man, you still got the big dog. The head of the table, the tribal chief down there. Yeah, remember when Hiccup told you you're not ready for this shit? Well, you're not ready for it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh! No! No! I could buy them a few minutes if I give that thing someone to hunt. Then I can double that time. I don't know if double it is really accurate. <laughs> I mean, Stoic's trying to be noble at this point, but I don't know. You you were a fool. Watch your backs. Move this legs. <laughs> oh, they get to go on the two header. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> He's got a lot of eyes. Can we please get toothless though? For the love of God. I've lost power on the protocol. Small out! Do something! Oh, okay, yeah, this dragon 
Viking relationship is not gonna last long. Hit <laughs> miss! What's wrong, buddy? You got something in your eye? <laughs> God! Is this, <laughs> this movie any more like horrifying? Are you shitting me? Dad? Hey! <laughs> he gave him the eye. He gave him the eye. He's like, I don't want to do this, but you get everybody gets one. I'm sorry. For, for everything. Damn right you should be sorry. I'm proud to call you my son. We need to get Poppy here to give him a big thumbs up. <laughs> oh my god, he's inhaling. Did you get her? <laughs> Why is um Toothless so scared of this big guy? Oh, okay. A big old wingling dragon. I can't believe I've gone this far into the movie without making a Trogdor reference. I really like this dragon. He's got spinities and consummate Vs. You gotta get some wings, like a little wingling dragon. God, this guy's like a flying fortress. He's a kaiju. <laughs> oh, we're up in the darkness. Where the night fury thrives. That looks cool. I didn't realize that's what lightning was, but here we are. We're good, just a little bit longer. I don't know how much longer you got with that thing on fire, man. That's his signature move. Shoot the fire back in the mouth. Oh. No. No. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Um, did he protect him in his wings? Hiccup! Oh, he's got his arms and legs around him. You brought him back alive! <laughs> thank you for saving my son. Damn right, you better thank him for saving your son. <laughs> See you too, right? Oh, my oh yeah. <laughs> oh, did he lose a leg? Uh -huh. Well, now you're like toothless. You got a little device on your lower end to help you get about. Toothless, stay here. Come on, guys, get ready! Hold on! <laughs> what? Okay, these what? Oh, people are riding the ones on the roofs? Okay, I thought they were just pests. <laughs> Turns out all we needed was a little worth. This. <laughs> That's very sweet. That's for scaring me. What? What? what is, was it always going to be this way? Because. I could get used to it. <laughs> <laughs> what was that all about? Yeah! We got the only dragons. upsides <laughs> are the pets. Yeah. I think my favorite character in all of this is Toothless. 100%. Just the way they made that um, dragon emote and the, <laughs> especially the uh, kind of patchy trust at the start of the relationship with Toothless and Hiccup. I thought they made that character very, very memorable. I think I've seen this dragon like 
I don't know, like drawn somewhere or like in a in a collar. Like I, I don't know where I've seen it, but I've definitely seen pictures of this dragon before, and I didn't know what to expect. And I definitely didn't expect it to be a big old giant kitty cat with scales and wings that can breathe fire. The rest of the movie was okay. The 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 trials and the the um, Viking classes or whatever it was. They weren't too bad. I mean, I, I kind of wish that they got us a bit more into those characters a little bit because they were pretty important at the end of the movie. And I don't know, I just hadn't really found a connection with those characters um, at all. Stoic, uh, he was an interesting character. Every time he kind of did something, it really, really meant a lot to the to the story well to my interpretation of the story anyway so stoic was a, a slightly underrated character let me have a look who was in the castling castling the cast list of this movie jay baruchel okay that's the guy who i keep forgetting the name of gerard butler was stoic okay cool america ferrera was astrid oh that's uh jane the virgin is that her Kristen Wiig is <laughs> rough nut. Jonah Hill was not loud. Yeah, I, remember, I recognize him. TJ Miller was in there as well. Okay. He was the other twin. Um, Craig Ferguson is Gobber. Yes. This is a hell of a cast. Kit Harrington, David Tennant, F. Murray Abraham, Nolan North, Rowan Atkin Downs. Is he like Rowan Atkinson from Wish? But since this is a DreamWorks movie, um, I'm going to have a quick look through all the DreamWorks movies and just say if I've seen any of these. I think I have seen a couple of these though, but let's start with Ants, 1998. I definitely saw that. I saw that in the movie theater. Prince of Egypt, haven't seen it, heard it's great. Road to El Dorado, haven't seen it, have also been told that it's very great. Chicken Run, I have seen that. I'm a big fan of Ardman Animation, Wallace and Gromit. If you've never seen Wallace and Gromit, The Wrong Trousers, it goes for about 20 minutes. Track it down and watch it because it is absolutely amazing. Joseph, King of Dreams. Nope, Shrek. Yes, I have seen Shrek. Spirit Stallion of the Cimarron. Oh yeah, I've definitely seen that. I haven't seen it. Sinbad, Legend of the Seven Seas. Nope. Is that about the comedian? I'm guessing it isn't. Is that the one where he is a um, genie that people remember that never happened? Shrek 2, I have seen that. Shark Tale, I think I have seen Shark Tale. Madagascar, I have not seen Madagascar. Wallace and Gromit, Curse of the Were-Rabbit. And Cheese Gromit, we need the Wensleydale. Over the Hedge, nope. Flushed Away, nope. Shrek the Third, you know what, I think I have. <laughs> I think I stuck with the Shrek movies, um, probably up until number three. B-movie, I haven't actually seen B-movie. That's Jerry Seinfeld. If you, if you think that's worth a look, let me know. Kung Fu Panda, I have seen Kung Fu Panda. I thought it was quite funny. Madagascar 2, nope. Monsters vs. Aliens, never seen it. How to Train Your Dragon, oh well, funny you should ask. Shrek Forever After, that's where I think I have stopped seeing the Shrek movies. Megamind, no, but a lot of people have said that I would enjoy that. Kung Fu Panda 2, maybe. Couldn't tell you. Puss in Boots, I haven't, and I haven't seen the second one either, but uh, a lot of people reacting to that at the moment. Probably should have done it myself. Madagascar 3, <laughs> Europe's Most Wanted, okay. Rise of the Guardians? The hell is that? The Croods? No, I haven't seen The Croods. Turbo, no. Mr. Peabody and Sherman, that's like an old-timey cartoon, isn't it? Uh, I haven't seen that. Anyway, uh, How to Train Your Dragon 2, have not seen it. Penguins of Madagascar, nope. Home, nope. Kung Fu Panda 3, don't think I saw that one. Trolls, <laughs> no, believe it or not. Boss Baby, god no, that looks absolutely dreadful. Do not put me through that, please. Captain Underpants, the first epic movie? Okay, uh, no, I haven't seen that one. How to Train Your Dragon, The Hidden World. There's three of them. Okay. Abominable. No, I haven't seen Abomina Abominable. I can't even say the word. Trolls World Tour. Oh my God, there was a second one. The Croods, A New Age. There's a second one of those. What do I feel like I'm scraping the bottle of the barrel with Trolls 2 and The Croods, A New Age. Spirit Untamed. I haven't seen it. The Boss. Oh, there's a sequel to Boss Baby. Wow. DreamWorks, you really pumped out those sequels, didn't you? The Bad Guys and Puss in Boots, The Last Wish. I have not seen either of those. What have they got coming up? <laughs> I was going to say Trolls 3. November 17, 2023. Trolls 3. Great. Ruby Gilman, Teenage Kraken. What the heck? Oh, Untitled Film. Nice. And a Kung Fu Panda 4 and Untitled. Okay. 
What they got in development here? Another Shrek movie. Oh god, a Bus Baby. Oh, really? Was Bus Baby that successful? Something called Dogman. That sounds like uh, Dean Pelton from Community would be into that. Wow, look at the looking at the worldwide unadjusted gross for all their movies. Shrek 2 is their highest grossing movie. That is crazy. No wonder they just pump it out. No wonder we've got Shrek 5 on the way. But let me know in the comments, which one do you want me to have a look at? I'm open to suggestions. I'm being pretty easy breezy and loosey goosey with my uh, cartoon Disney Pixar DreamWorks reactions. I have a weird feeling that the sequel to this was quite good. With that being said, again, I feel like that's dangerous territory, especially when we've got Boss Baby 3 in development at the moment. But let me know what you do want to see on the channel. And as always, everyone, be well, stay safe, look after your friends. See you in the next video. Peace.